While it is possible to replace the sensors without removing the rear bumper and side mufflers, it is almost impossible to get pictures of the procedure. If this is the first time doing this, I recommend you remove the rear bumper and mufflers on your 991.1. Need additional assistance with that task? Please follow the link provided at the end of this video. With the bumpers and mufflers off, you will have access to the cylinder heads. There are two heat shields between the heads and the mufflers that you need to remove. The heat shields are held in place by four E10 torque screws and indicated by red arrows. Remove the screws and slide the heat shields back and down and out from between the head and the muffler bracket. It will be a tight fit, but there is no need to bend the shields. With the heat shields out of the way, you can easily access the camshaft positioning sensor, red arrow, right side shown. Due to the position of the sensors directly above the cats, they see a tremendous amount of heat. This can make the small, delicate electrical connector very brittle, red arrow. Use care when pressing in and separating the electrical connection. Use a T30 torque and remove the single screw holding the sensor in place, red arrow. Slowly twist and pull the sensor from its port in the engine and be prepared for a small amount of oil to spill. Installation is the reverse of removal. If you are reinstalling the old sensor, always make sure to replace the O-ring. There's a lot of work to get to these and you do not want to do it all again because an old O-ring drips oil. Both the sensor screw and the heat shield screws are torqued to 10 newton meters or 7.5 foot pounds. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.